Hey everybody, Monty back, and we've made it to episode 10 of Fallout. Now, we've done some fun stuff, Shady Sands, we've done Junk Town, we hit up the hub. We're going to come back to the hub, but I noticed we did a bunch of gambling and spent all our money, and I actually would have to come back and gamble more if I want more money. I should have actually been bringing money, now that I think about it. We'll see how it goes without doing that. I've got my sniper rifle. And I'm gonna stick with my small guns because that's where my skills are. We got 119 days left. Let's go find this water chip. Now I know the necropolis has a bunch of water, so let's see what they know about it. Let's see if we can get something done. Lots of zombies, lots of undead. I might even oh an event. Here we go. Be a UFO. Oh no. This is a preview. It's gonna be zombie killing. Uh, I might even do just a like a montage of put a little bit of music in the background and let it just play when I go and kill some of these little dungeons and stuff. Uh, you know, I don't want to be just chatting off your ear the whole time, but I don't want to just skip it. I want you guys to actually see where I play and all the undead explosions and unmemberment. Boom, like that. How that didn't just get all over me, I don't know. Oofs, you scrags are all alike. Oh man, this is gonna be fun. I'm excited, we've gotta get some uh, newer Fallout. I'm, so, out of everything that's come out, I know it's tough to just cling on to the classic, but what's your favorite Fallout game of all time? And if they make a Fallout 4, if, if and when, fingers crossed, what do we think is going to happen? Where is it going to be? Where would you like it to be? You know, we need something like down south too, like Mexico, maybe make it even a little bit tropical, something like that. I think that would be fun. Uh, you know, or mix it up, have it kind of split some helicopters or something away in the future so you can have more Alaska stuff, all that. You know, that's what I got to do in Fallout 3 is I never played that downloadable content. So here I am chatting away doing nothing. I think we're done with the combat. Uh, we can search these guys. I doubt they're going to have much. Yeah, those guys didn't have anything. Let's head out. Moving right along, Necropolis. Look how huge this city was. Salt Lake City, maybe? You guys let me know. What? Necropolis. Uh, yeah, Nevada's down here. California is somewhere. I don't really remember. I'm all lost here. What is Necropolis? So we're going to go right to the hotel is the only place we can jump in. Now basically we got to find, oh here's some hole cover. Right here, that's what we got to do. Now these guys are undead, they don't really say much. They're ghouls, they're ugly, and they just want to punch you. So straight up, sniper rifle to the face. <laughs> yeah, not really to the face, just this whole side. Uh, so you want to take care of all these guys. The reason why I like my small gun too is I can get off two shots and that's handy. So I'm going to switch over to that. I've got the sledgehammer on, but my melee sucks. Look, these guys are just tearing it up. Boom and kill and boom and kill and come on, do it. Yes. That's the commander that we want to see, killing it off from up top. Oh, can I not? Do I have to kill all these guys? I got to get all aggressive now? We'll see. I want to go down this hole cover here. Do do do. Get underground. See if we can get get away from these crazy ghouls. Oh, you cannot while well, there's hostile creatures nearby. There we go. Now we're down. So we got some things, some mole creatures, and let's switch back to my SMG as my backup. This is not one of those games where you like level up by using it. So you're gonna you're gonna want to. Uh, just use what you're good at when you level up and what you skill up with. So I'm still my small guns. Uh, I can't bring out my character sheet right now. But I want to get my energy guns because we're going to pick up a energy gun sometime soon, hopefully. I know one thing that I'm hoping for is like going out and a random encounter is finding this alien UFO. Killing mole rats. Now some of this stuff I'll skip, but this is early on. We're going to just get to finding out about this uh, water pump. 
in Necropolis. Oh, swing and a miss. My guys will take care of it. I think I'm more just along for the ride in commentary and looking good as Natalia. These guys just cleaned house. So in combat, what do we got? What? Lick it. It's the cattle prod. Uh, I don't remember the damage though. I'm at capacity. What? No. So here we're going to do some pack mule and stuff. Press number three key, which is the steel key. I'm going to give him some medical kits. I'm stealing him into his bag. He's going to be like, why? Why is everything so heavy now? And I'm not going to tell him. Let's get rid of the gun. Let's get rid of the power sledge. Let's get rid of the knife. And there we go. That's good for now. Yes, cattle prod. So remember that. You go down the sewer, just right down south to all these mole rats. Hit character. No. But see, yeah, here's this. Look at my big guns. It's only 10. Energy weapons is sadly only 10. But we're going to level up pretty quick here. We got a lot of stuff to kill. Look at my hit points. I don't use this very much. Let's uh, first aid myself. Boom, boom, some time goes by, and I healed myself a little bit. Now I'm going to doctor myself, see if I can get that up. Nah, I didn't fail to do any healing. Let's try to first aid one more time. Boom, 27 out of 45, so might stim pack it. I didn't realize I was hurting that bad. Let me try a doctor one more time. Mmm, fail to do any healing. Got to get that doctor skill up. See, and that's why we learned, and I forgot until I got to the hub with the whole library trick. I totally wasted a ton of skills on small guns and first aid. Because I could have picked it all up through gambling and just buying the books. These guys don't have anything on them, but make sure you check all the ghouls. Uh, I'll show you where there's the other important one that's up here. This is about where I caught up before I lost my save. So I had to replay all this, but I'm back into it. Here we are. Uh, I'm gonna just reload and go see what's up. Thank you for not shooting first. Can I help you? Yeah, looking for water. Okay, the surface of Necropolis and the water is controlled by Set and his ghouls. Uh, your ghouls. Okay, we're a much more peaceful group, which disgusts Set. Okay, who's Set? Set is a ghoul like us, but he has assumed a certain amount of power. Huh, he sounds a lot more interesting than you freaks. Uh, why does he let you survive down here? Let's be a little bit nicer here. This guy's kind of being all right. We're going to kill enough ghouls, all right? All right? Put the gun down. Put the gun down. Uh, he does not speak of it, however. Uh, Sid is afraid of not having enough people to defend Necropolis, so... Okay, so these guys are still like backup militia, so he gives them water. Uh, where does all the water come from? Until recently, we pumped our water from the ground uh, uh, with a pump from in the watershed. Until recently, what happened? A lot of things happened. Uh, someone took control, however, our rations are still being delivered for some reason. Hmm. <clears throat> How do I get to the watershed? The watershed is to the north. You'll need to take the sewers to get there. Okay, we're in the sewers, not a problem. Uh, you weren't thinking of taking the water chip from us, were you? Uh, maybe. My people need the water chip to survive. Well, if you take it, we will die. With our water pump broken, we need it to survive. Okay. Uh, let's see. Can we fix your water pump? Of course. Why is that so difficult? Okay, the sewers, there's filled with monsters, blah, blah, blah. Yes, let's do it. Thank you. When you get the parts, return here. Boom. Sewer quest, Necropolis, fix the water pump. And they've got the water chip. This is it. So we've got to head north. Oh, good, good ghouls, bad ghouls. All right, play that game. Yeah, we're going to head north, and we're going to be killing stuff. Now, definitely go up here and start killing these things. And these things, as in all these rats <laughs> and the mole rats up top. 
take care of all of them. Basically, I just start this combat, so my team just starts going crazy. We've got so much ammo, and we can always go back to the hub, because now we're in the... Whoo, that was a splatter. Now, um, we're going to get the water chip. Once we turn that in, we don't have the time crunch that we've had so far. And then we can really kind of just play around, go find a bunch of special weapons, level up, and then have fun finding out all the side quests and all the cool stuff from there. Next week I am going to be going on down to California for a week. So there'll be a little bit of break in my videos, but not much. I hope to still get a few videos made before that trip. So it should be fun. And I'm going to be down right in LA while E3 is going on. Don't know if I'm going to be able to make it, but man, that would be just awesome. If I do, of course, I'm going to be making videos and posting it and showing you guys. Also, I got some alpha game footage and maybe another interview coming up for a very XCOM-like game. Not going to say it yet, still a little bit early to say, uh, but they kind of have a little touch of Fallout and things like that. Pretty fun so far, still early access, but I'm going to be having a new video of that coming up as well. See, so I guess I, I did have things. We almost killed... We almost killed a whole room of stuff while I was just chatting away there. Alright, let's switch over to our other gun here. And let's get our burst mode on. Bring it, mole rat. Ba da 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 <laughs> That's some damage. Now, let's see what we got up here. In combat? What do you got? I'm feeling something special. Ah! Oh. This is where I was. I just about lost my save right about here. Plasma pistol. My energy skills are not there, but we got a cow prod and the plasma pistol. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So, those are cool things. Now, if you guys notice me walk by any little hint or tip or something that you guys know of that I missed, please let me know and we'll hit it up. Now this, let's see what's, I don't think this is far enough north, but let's see what's here. Because this is not, th these are not the stairs you are looking for. Whoa. Oh, wow. So we got glowers. This is the big church, and this is going to be set right here. Yep, there's the leader. This is just a weird small room, sewage room, I guess. There's no way in. Maybe I could blow it up, but it's more just to show you, hey, this is where they are, give you a, a sneak peek. We have to keep going north. So north we shall go. And yeah, hopefully we'll zone up. Yep, we just zoned up and out. And there's a break here. It's kind of like Dungeon Master or something like that. Or really old school Diablo. That was fun times. We have to get over here. I'm just keeping an eye out, like, okay, there's a sewer hole and some stairs right here. Stairs, ladder, same thing. There's a ladder over here, and there's a ladder over here. So when we get above ground, that should, should match up. Let's see. I'm going to get to the surface, and I'm going to save the game, because I'm done not saving enough. Alright, what's up? What's up? Get up there. Get up there. There's a... There we go. <clears throat> Alright, so there was... There was a hole up here, I think. And then we've got this one up here. Whoa! Our first... Hey, it's Larry. It's Larry the Cable Guy. And, whoop, oh, who's this guy? We've got Children of the Cathedral. I like how they split this here to where they have open roofs to where you can kind of see these little kind of hints of where to go. So okay, this was good. I think we are currently in the watershed. Catch more next time, next episode with Moni here, and we're going to be playing some more in the Necropolis. Let's see if we can fight off all these guys and gals, ghouls, guys, and gals. 
And uh, hopefully, next episode, we will have the water pump and be running back heroes of the game, water chip in hand, game over, right? We'll see. We'll see. All right, guys. See you next time. Thanks for watching.